Hey guys, welcome to Jen's Creativity Corner. Today is day 10 already of our 21 day lockdown virtual escape room. If you haven't watched the others, make sure to check out the playlist down below so you're not jumping into the middle of it. And we are almost halfway through. How crazy is that? Halfway through our lockdowns? Probably not, but <laughs> halfway through this particular adventure. We are still in the kitchen, so let's go ahead and jump into that. I'm gonna go ahead and show you a review of what the room looks like, and then we're going to get the answer to yesterday's puzzle. So this was the paper clue that we got last time. The first of the first of the f is the first. The second of the second is the second. Third of the third is the third. Fourth of the fourth is the fourth. You can figure it out, which we have numbers on a few of these canned foods. And the names are kind of uh, squared in there. So that kind of narrows down what you're looking at. So the first one, the first letter is a B. So that's the first place on this four letter lock. The second can, second letter is O for gourmet, so that is the second letter on the combination. Third is E, and then the fourth is S. So B O E S, is that what you got on there? So I'm curious, did you get it? Did you have any troubles figuring that one out? Go ahead and comment down below, and then let's open our lockbox and see what is inside and what our next puzzle is. Okay, and here we are getting another bottle with some water in it and a red sticker. We're going to set off that off to the side because there's not really any other clues about it. And then this container, you can twist apart the different sections. Uh, we've got some green polka dot tape. We've got some numbers, some dots. We've got um, some mysterious white powders. Okay, like some we've had before, this is a bit of a two-part problem that you need to solve. and. We're only gonna do the first part for today's question, if that makes sense. So I want you to tell me, what are we doing with the contents of this lockbox? And when we do that action, how do you think we will come up with the numbers or letters that we need to open the next combination? In tomorrow's video, we will do the action and then you'll have a moment to pause and make sure that you're figuring out the right combination because it's not necessarily right away gonna tell you, oh, the combination is one, two, three, A, B, C. If you're liking these videos, please do give it a thumbs up and share so other people can join in on the fun. And please do subscribe and hit the notification bell so that way you know when the next video comes up. I'm trying to do them around 3 p.m. Mountain Standard Time daily, as long as my schedule allows. I appreciate you so much joining me for this and we will see you tomorrow with answers part one and two.